Well, it turns out I was wrong. This is the regular three-speed clutch. This is the three-speed coaster brake clutch, as I found out when I looked in there. But this one is brand new, and the edges are sharp on it. So, I've got this thing mostly apart. Um, that's the cone that holds the bearings there in the cup. So, three speeds have a flat edges on two sides, so I've got it in a bar clamp down there just to hold it still. So, take the sprocket off. And then you can take the driver out. That's this gizmo here. Um, these, uh, it's hard to explain, so I won't. But now we're getting into it. You can see that's the clutch down there. This is called the ball ring. And that's got double threads on it there and threads into the hub uh, a video I made a long time ago on Facebook about this hub includes these brass washers so I'm gonna have to upload that as part four or something but I suspect that I can take the clutch out at this point Oh my god, it gets so complicated so quick here. There we go, look at that. I just lifted it off. But, yeah, let's see here. What do we got? I don't know, that looks... Those do not look mauled. I don't know what's going on. I'm going to have to do some inspecting here and see why I'm skipping. But this thing's been skipping and it cannot, this will not abide. All right, well, that's some of a three speed coaster brake hub. Uh, trying to get this part out over here. Can't do it. Ah, I will. Hold on. Alright. Yes. Alright, so there we go. That's the bottom level. That's the planet ring. And then this goes. on here like that and then this bit goes on here you got to get all this shit all together at the right time uh, I don't have it right now but it doesn't matter anyway there we go that's all in this is the part I'm going to inspect. And uh, let's pull this off. This is the planet cage. Will it come off of here? Eh, it might not come off of here because of that friggin' three speed coaster brake dealio there. Anyway, that's enough for me.